In this quickie with Exegius, we'll look at unlocking the engineer Celine Jean. You'll first need to work through unlocking Todd McQuinn and ranking him up to grade 3 to discover her and mine 500 tons of ore to receive her invitation. As she is the only engineer capable of modifying armor and hull reinforcements, she is extremely important to anyone who wants to engage in advanced combat, specifically PvP or Thargoid combat, so let's take a look at the most efficient way to unlock Selene Jean. Once you've unlocked and ranked Todd the Blaster McQuinn to grade 3, you'll learn of Miss Jean. You'll then need to mine a total of 500 tons of any type of ore to receive her invitation. This can be any type of ore you'd like. It just needs to be refined by you and sold on any market. This can be done in any mining ship you'd like. For a guide on mining, see my complete tutorial linked on screen now. Once you've received her invitation, you'll need to mine 10 tons of painite and donate it to her for the final unlock. You'll find painite in pristine metallic rings. I used Delcar 7 A ring and found 10 tons of painite in a single asteroid. The closest pristine metallic ring to you can be found using EDDB from the Bodies tab, entering pristine for system reserve, metallic for ring type, entering your reference system and clicking find bodies. I suggest skipping belts as they will have far fewer asteroids to mine. While unlocking Selene Jean can be one of the most time intensive of all the engineers, you should be able to mine the necessary minerals in less than two hours with a large class ship. Given the importance of the armor and hull engineering she offers, along with her being the stepping stone to both Dee Dee Vaderman and Bill Turner, Selene Jean is a critical engineer for any aspiring combat pilot. Once again, this has been Commander Exegius reminding you to fly dangerously and thanks for watching. If you enjoyed that quickie with Exegius, I hope you'll check out my other content and join me on my weekly live streams, Tutorial Tuesdays, and the Creators Roundtable each Friday, and that you'll consider supporting my efforts via Patreon. 